The exact cause of Friday's crash of Virgin Galactic Spaceship 2 won't be known for months, but the National Transportation Safety Board says the spaceship's feathering system, which rotates the tail to create drag, was activated before the spacecraft reached the appropriate speed. The system requires a two-step process. Investigators say the co-pilot unlocked the system, okay, yeah, but the second, the second step location. occurred without being piece. commanded. Approximately two seconds after the feathering parameters indicated that the lock-unlock lever was moved from lock to unlock. The feathers moved toward the extended position, the deployed position, even though the feather handle itself had not been moved. That finding contradicts initial speculation that an explosion brought down the spacecraft, but doesn't fully explain why the disaster occurred. There is Meanwhile, Richard Branson, Virgin Galactic's founder, said the company will move forward despite the crash. We have spent many, many years building a spacecraft, a mothership, a, space, a spaceport um, that I think can do the job. The pilot, Peter Siebold, parachuted to the ground and was seriously hurt. The co-pilot, 39-year-old Michael Alsbury, was killed in the accident. Ned Barker, The Associated Press.